this is after the Praga against Real Madrid match in which we all expected Ardegula to make his debut because just the entire time like, he joined Real Madrid in July big hype around him making his debut then he got injured for about a month then he came back after that full month he got injured again he was out for another month after that month came back was in training but Ancelotti was delaying his debut saying he will only be ready in November. We in November. The matches for November were Ravalcano in which Ardo was ready for his debut. And no one can say he wasn't because he was posting about it. He was ready to play. Then the Braga match which happened last night was possibly the best opportunity to give this player a debut. In which this is the question. This is what I'm asking. What is Ancelotti? What is Ancelotti's deal? He gave Nico Perez a debut yesterday in which Nico Perez was great. He was great, he had the most dribbles. He was outstanding. But we all expected Arda to make his debut first in which Ancelotti came out after the match with a statement saying yet again at the moment wasn't right and he scared to play Arda because he came from a serious injury. Which is understandable, there might be things we don't know. But honestly, the player is ready. He's playing in every training session. So why is he not even given at least 5 minutes? I don't know what's up with Ancelotti. He has a fear of playing young players. He has a huge fear of using Castilla or any teenagers in the team. I don't know where this is from, but he's been coaching for... I don't know how long, 50 years or something. Maybe has some PTSD, we don't know. Maybe he feels a youngster and it went terribly. But Ancelotti is the worst when it comes to using young players. So now we ask the question, when will we see Arda make his debut? The next match against Valencia. I have a question, do you think he will play against Valencia? The answer is no. So don't expect him to play against Valencia. Praga were not a physical team. Valencia are a super physical team. I mean, you saw what they did with Funny. Like, they are a very physical team. And then after the Valencia game, which he definitely is not playing, it's international break, in which he probably will play for Turkey. So I think that's the first time we'll see Arda play in the season. I mean, that's something. And then guess what matches after the international break? It's against Caddies. Caddies, oh my word. You don't get more physical than Caddies. Caddies are like... Actually, most of the Liga teams are super physical. I would say they're more physical. La Liga is a physical based league. They're not like the Premier League, where it's about football. La Liga is where you get away with Red card challenges. So I think Valencia, they will go out to kill the player. Cadiz will kill this youngster. And then it all depends on who we face later on. But I do think in the international break, he will play for Turkey. And when he plays for Turkey, I think Ancelot is going to see that he actually can play. And I think he will play against Cadiz. That's my word. Because the best moment in my opinion to, to play him was against Praga. Which he didn't do. So he's definitely not playing against Valencia. Who knows if we're even going to win that match. But I expect him to play against Cadiz. That's my opinion. I know that is disappointing to you. Because we're all excited to see him play. I mean you're not the only one. I, but I was fuming. I was like. Good he's putting Nico Perez on. Which I'm, I was happy about. But then he put Frank Garcia on. As the final sub. And I was like. What is Ancelotti? What is he doing? What is he planning? What's going on in his head? The thing is he's scared to play. Why? I can tell you why. I think it's because he has favourites in the team. But I mean by that Vinny and Rodrigo are his favourites. So let's just say Ardo outperforms him. Then what? Is he going to drop Rodrigo who is his favourite? I think it, it stems from a lot of stuff. He doesn't want to play the guy too soon, which is fine. He came from a serious injury. But give what the fans also want. 
But I mean that's that's my thoughts. Nico Pez, let me talk about him quick. When Nico Pez came on in the 74th minute, he was a bit nervous, you could see he was nervous making his debut. But then when he got on the ball, straight up dribbled almost everyone, made good passes. Nico Pez, I think he is gonna be in the first team by next season. Because Modric is going to leave. I don't know if Sabayos will stay. He probably will go on alone. In which then I think Nico Pérez should play. Argentine is 19. Bro, this guy is literally the future. No other words. But that's it for now. If you enjoyed, smash like, subscribe.